interested in. One is our vision of actually making gender equality at the center of agriculture and especially at the center of transforming food systems. So how can we make gender equality part of that discussion? How can we make the voice of women who then can also decide what food system they want? How do we make the invisible visible? There's still a lot of knowledge that we need on gender issues, on gender dynamics, on how do we actually do transform systems that actually allow for women's voice in there, for instance. The other part also is how do we improve the system and not just the woman? We've had a long tendency of saying, well, we need to educate more women, et cetera, et cetera. But I think it's also understanding the system and how can we make the system better so that everybody becomes better out of the system. And we're trying to do that through three ways. We have three modules. One is called the evidence module, where we're looking at evidence gaps, what we need, what information we still need to actually move the agenda forward. The other one is methods, which is also very exciting. We're actually trying to bring all the methods that the CG has done on gender and make sure that they can be used by other people. So not just the CG, but the whole agricultural system. And the last one, which is very important too, is the alliance. How do we build alliances with people to make sure that that gender voice gets heard? And I think that's where it's very important for us as well to build the new generation of gender researchers. This is one of our important parts because if we have those, we can actually move forward. If we stop without and not build the new generation, we'll never get there. A lot of the things that you usually do are difficult and also getting that research done has been difficult so we've had to move a little bit slower than I'd hoped. It's also highlighted a lot of the work that women do, family household labor that they provide and I think that's again given us an impetus to say look women need to be there at the beginning of the conversation. Leadership is important and you do need to show where you want to go, have a vision of where you want to go. And I think Ilri really is placed at the moment on gender and livestock in a, in a wonderful way. I think that's amazing. And I see the CG moving that way. I see we bringing everyone on the CG on board to move it forward. And that requires leadership, that requires people with a vision, that requires people who can see, oh, let's make sure that gender is part of the food system transformation. And the other part, besides leadership, I think is very important, is perseverance. Perseverance, and I think every gender person will smile at that because that's the one thing we've had. We've constantly been, we've shown up, we've, we've been there. And I think that's still an important part of what we do. We need to make sure that we have the resources to have people in all the projects. Just having somebody do a gender analysis is not enough. We need people who are actually there to make sure it gets implemented, that we get the outputs.